Hi guys! This is the second part of the video where I'm talking about technical settings that needed for great deliverability and email security. In the previous video, we've set up an SPF record to protect your domain from being used to send spam. And in this video, we will add a DKM record for G Suite accounts to secure your email content. The main keys identified email, which is called DKM, is a way to authenticate and protect your domain. Such key helps to verify your message and email content to keep good deliverability. To add your DKIM records, you will need to have an access to your admin account of your email provider. In my case, it will be G Suite admin account, where you will need to generate DKIM key, which is unique for each user. Also, you will need to have an access to your domain name settings where you will be able to save all generated keys. Also, we've prepared help article which is called What is DKM? where we gathered all guides from different email accounts with information how to set up a DKM record. So the first step that we need to do, we need to go to admin account. In my case, it's a G Suite account. You will need to go to Apps, G Suite, and to choose Gmail from the list. Then you will need to choose section which is called Authenticate Email, and here you will be able to generate your DKM key. Okay, first of all, you will need to select a proper domain in case you have some domains, different ones under one G Suite account. So in my case, it's a domain Woodpecker SEO. Then you have a button which is called generate new record and you need to click on this button to generate the proper value. In my case, I have did before. After this, you can go to your domain name settings account. You will also need to choose DNS management section and you can add a new record. As a type, you need to choose a TXT record as uh, this type of record is needed for the KM key. As a host, you will need to copy information from uh, G Suite admin account and you will need to paste it to your DNS. And as a TXT value, you also will need to copy uh, this long record which consists of different letters and numbers and to paste it here. Time section will leave without any changes. Then you need to click save and that's it. You've added your DKM record. After this step, you will need to go back to your uh, Google admin account and you will need to click on the start authentication button. So then system will be able to activate your DKM record. And it may take up to 48 hours for DNS changes to be fully saved on your domain host account. Also, I would like to present you our new feature, deliverability section, where you will be able to check the correctness of your SPF and DKM records inside our app without using any external tools. Right now, while adding your email account to Woodpecker, you will be able to see notifications about your SPF and DKM records and if they were set up in a correct way. Also, you can go to our deliverability section, which is available under email accounts button. And as you can see, in my case, everything looks fine and my domain settings are correct. In case you will provide any changes to your records in the future, each time from Woodpecker view, you will be able to refresh your settings to see if they are still correct and working in a proper way. It can take a few minutes for a system to refresh your settings. And as you can see, system update my records and shows me that everything looks fine. Thank you for watching our videos. In case of any questions and ideas connected with our new recordings, please let us know and subscribe us on YouTube. Your feedback is very important for us. Bye.